हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू सॉल्व दिस मैथ ओलंपियड अलजबरा प्रॉब्लम एंड हियर वी हैव स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ x प्लस स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ x माइनस 30 इक्वल्स टू 10 एंड वी सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम फॉर द वैल्यूज ऑफ x सो हियर वी फाइंड दोस वैल्यूज व्हिच सेटिस्फाइड द गिवन इक्वेशन एंड आफ्टर दैट वी चेक इट्स सॉल्यूशन ओके सो द वेरी फर्स्ट स्टेप वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज हियर फर्स्ट uh, we move uh, this k root x to the right hand side. Over now, our first target is to eliminate both of these radical signs. So, in order to eliminate these radical signs, uh, here we need to move this k root x to the right hand side, and it will be written as square root of x minus 30 equals to 10 minus square root of x. And now uh, here in order to remove this radical sign we need to take a square on both of the side okay take square on both sides of the given equation uh, so when you take a square it will be written as a square root of x minus 30 and its whole square equals to 10 minus square root of x and its whole square and now in the next step uh, here we need the nice square identity in the right hand side and you know that if we have a minus b whole square it is equals to a square plus b square minus 2 times of a b so here we need uh, this uh, square identity in the right hand side uh, but in the left hand side uh, we just directly cancelled this 2 and square root so after cancellation our left hand side is written as x minus 30 is equals to this is 10 minus square root of x we use this nice formula here according to this formula we write its right hand side as 10 square plus uh, square root of x whole square and minus 2 times of 10 into square root of x okay in uh, in the next step uh, we have this is 10 square and 10 square equals 200 plus this 2 and square root are cancelled by each other and we get x and this 2 times of 10 becomes here 20 into square root of x and in the left hand side we have x minus 30. So in the start of this problem uh, I just says that we just our first target is to just eliminate this square root sign. So uh, now again we separate this square root term and we move all these terms in the left hand side. So in the left hand side we have x minus 30 when we move this plus 100 here it will becomes minus 100 and this plus x is written as minus x and in the right hand side we have the only terms are minus 20 into square root of x. So here we need uh, some simplification in the left hand side and we add or subtract the like terms. So you see that this is negative x and positive x are cancelled by each other and we obtain minus 30 minus 100 equals to minus 130 is equals to this is minus 20 into square root of x. So now in the next step uh, we need more simplification and we move this minus 20 in the left hand side so here this minus 20 is multiplied by square root of x when we move in the left hand side it is divided by here so it will be written as minus 130 is divided by minus 20 and it is equals to square root of x and now we need more simplification and these negative uh, terms are cancelled by each other and here uh, you see that uh, this 0 is cancelled out by this 0 and uh, the simplified form of this fraction is written as 13 over 2 and it is equals to square root of x. So because in this question our target is to find the value of x so here we need again uh, to take the square on both of the sides because we eliminate this radical sign okay so again take a square on both of the sides 
so when you take square on both of the sides so it will be written as 13 over 2 square equals to square root of x and its whole square so now in the next step uh, here uh, we just apply the square on upside and downside and it will be written as 13 square divided by 2 square and here we cancel this 2 and square root and we get here x only and now in the next step we know that uh, the square uh, so when you cancel these one so uh, here we get only x so uh, 13 square equals to 169 and 2 square equals to 4 equals to x so this is the uh, solution of the given equation and now we verify the solution is this solution satisfied our given question statement or not so that to check this solution here first we copy down the given question statement and our given question is square root of x plus square root of x minus 30 equals to 10 and now we use uh, this value in the left hand side and we check is uh, the left hand side is equals to 10 or not okay so here we substitute the value of x and we have 169 over 4 square root and plus square root of 169 divided by 4 minus 30 and we check is this equals to 10 or not okay so here uh, we just separate the square root on both of these terms and it will be written as square root of 169 divided by square root of 4 plus here we need to take the lcm of this term and its LCM is 4 so you get here 169 minus uh, 120 square root and we check is this equals to 10 or not so here uh, we know that the square root of 169 is equals to 13 and the square root of 4 is equals to 2 plus uh, 169 minus uh, 120 is equals to 49 so this is equals to 49 over 4 uh, and here we just separate the square root on both of these terms in this form and we check is this equals to 10 okay so now uh, in the next step uh, here we have this is 13 over 2 plus we know that 49 square root equals to 7 and 4 square root equals to 2 and we check is this equals to 10 and now again we take the LCM of this term and our LCM is 2 and we have 13 plus 7 and we check is this equals to 12, 10 so 13 plus 7 equals to 20 divided by 2 and is this equals to 10 so here you have 2 tens are 20 so this implies that 10 is equals to 10 so this shows that left hand side equals to right hand side it means that the value of x 169 over 4 is satisfied this equation and this is the only solution of this given equation and thank you so much for watching this video Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.